Automation is everywhere. Incredible growth in technologies built with things like artificial intelligence and machine learning has made the list of things that we can automate bigger than ever before. And now you can add something unexpected to that list, grocery stores. In 2016, Amazon introduced this concept to the public when it opened its first Amazon Go store in Seattle. Now, a startup in San Francisco is trying to bring that experience to everyone else. At Zipin, our mission is to banish checkout lines for good. You can simply walk in, check in when you enter, pick up whatever you want, and simply walk out. Zipin says that Americans spend more than 100 hours a year standing in lines, and it wants to change that. But Zipin is a software provider, not a retailer. The goal is to license its platform to other retailers like grocery stores or convenience stores. If there was somebody, a human, that actually were able to follow a customer around the store and, and see what they were picking and just took a note of that uh, information, and then when they walked out, simply just gave them a bill, it would be very convenient for the customer. But since having a personal shopping assistant isn't feasible for most of us, Zippin has developed a way to do the same sort of thing with cameras, sensors, and AI. We use uh, overhead cameras that look straight down and get a bird's eye view of the entire store. Uh, that allows us to uniquely identify customers and we use that information to also understand which items they're picking from the shelf, which ones they're putting back. This information is paired with sensors that are on the shelf that work with the cameras to accurately identify which products got picked. Zipin has to track your every move for this to work, which brings up some obvious privacy concerns. Retailers will know things like how long you stood there staring at the shelf or which things you picked up but didn't ultimately buy. As we've seen in the online world, where e-commerce customers can actually see which product you've clicked on, how long you've actually considered it, or whether you put it in the cart or taken it out, there will be retailers that will be responsible in the way they use that information. Zippin says its goal is to be extremely privacy friendly. The system doesn't track your face, it can't even see your face. And any imagery collected during a shopping session is thrown out when you leave. Zipin is not the only company trying to get rid of checkout lines. Across San Francisco is another startup, Standard Cognition, which is developing a very similar technology. Their version doesn't use shelf sensors, only cameras. And it's been reported that Amazon is considering opening 3,000 of its cashierless stores by 2021. I think I would say five to 10 years, you should expect every store uh, would be checkout free. Zipin will charge stores a monthly fee to use its software, and it estimates that it will cost stores around $25 a square foot to install hardware that its system supports. But it predicts stores will make that money back in about 6 to 12 months. In addition to um, supermarkets and grocery stores, we're also getting a lot of interest from hotels, airports, stadiums, and commercial buildings, right? Because for the first time, this technology allows you to operate a store uh, more cost efficiently. And so we expect more of these smaller stores to appear, pop up in residential complexes and office buildings where there was nothing other than just a vending machine with some salty snacks before. Our next step is to actually take the technology to an existing retailer and implement it in their stores. <laughs>